Yeah, he's going to try to see how far he can go through there. That, yep, good choice. I like that choice. That'd be my choice, too. Because there's still a lot of beans right there, and he's rolling good on that land. Everybody's been wondering where Cousin Scott was at. There he is. Yeah, that's impressive to me. That's about 20, 25, that's about 30 yards where this tire over here started, you know, sinking and spinning. That one was still doing pretty good, so that's about half the distance of that. That he let it fight on along before he knew got to stop. Boy, it'd be so cool. I'm 61. Scott's three years younger than me, so that makes him about 58 or something along about that. He's got a birthday coming up, he'll turn 59. But if we could somehow manage to get retired from our jobs, and since we get along so well with one another, we could have us a partnership, you know, farming this farm to keep it in the deferment program. Not like, you know, need to earn a living off of it. You know, we'd both have our Social Security retirement and our 401k retirement stuff to actually have a living off of. But just every time I get a chance to come out here and work with Cousin, it's always a fun day. Always a fun day and always creates a good memory. Okay, that's just pure delight to me right there. That's the last little streak. And I'm pretty sure he can get it in one header width of the two acre piece that we're going to be able to get today. This uh, stuff down here on this end over here, right there, just way too wet. Can't get in there. I mean, but that right there, you know, that's all my zoom. That's going to finish up the two acre piece, and I'll go over there and see what's in the hopper. We'll probably and empty that thing out before he starts out here on this land, spinning through that. Yeah, I figured, you know, if the ground had been dry, what was left out here, uh, hour and 45 minutes, two hours at the most, I could have strolled right through it and picked it. But I know as much as Cousin enjoys uh, operating combine tractors and all, he's having a good time in there, and I am delighted to have him here. I can't say enough about my appreciation for him being here today. Yeah, it looks like he managed to, yeah, he got it all in one pass. Well, let me go down there and see what he wants to do about the other field. I don't know where he's going to come back this way or start crossing down to that bottom. Kind of hope he don't cross that bottom. Hope he comes back up here and crosses. He's making the turn to come back this way. Good choice. Yeah, it's real wet down there. It'd dig some serious ruts. All right. We'll talk and figure this out.